I've been inspired by lots actually. It's been really, really interesting to just sit and have the time and talk to other people, um, hear other opinions. Something I'll take with me is more community links, parents, children, bringing everyone together, which is something we try to do, um, but we can do more of it. I believe our children have a massive voice. I think it's important to teach them to use their voice responsibly, so to develop their communication skills, they can share their ideas in a sensible way. So for me, um, I was completely inspired by the amount of people who are also singing from the same page that we are as well, and that they want to promote conservation within schools. As a former teacher um, and as an ecologist, I'm really passionate about that, and I just found it really exciting that there's other people striving for similar outcomes um, and I think for me um, to be able to take that back to my organisation and share it with the people that I work with but equally with the schools that I work with and show them that it's like it can be easily done as well as you know fulfilling the Ofsted framework. So for me the one big change if I had all the money in the world and all the influence in the world would be um, to embed this in teacher training. I think it's really important that we get teachers at the very beginning of their journey, TAs at the beginning of their journey when they're doing their qualifications in college, um, to show them how important that outdoor learning, conservation is um, for our young people um, and also for our natural world and for the future of our planet. Conservation learning should be available in every key stage in the curriculum because it's such a hot topic and a really big issue that is going to affect those young people's future. I think people need to listen more to young people. They need to uh, create more young people-led learning rather than this is what we're learning today. Um, get them out there so they can see the issues themselves firsthand and then make a decision themselves on what they think and their opinions and then what action should be taken and maybe learn from others that are doing positive actions. Everybody was really passionate about environmental conservation and education. Sometimes when you're out there doing it yourself, you kind of feel like everybody else, like parents and schools, aren't on, as on board as, as they should be, but it's nice to speak to people um, and make connections so you can work together to kind of create this bigger picture.